The qualifiers were postponed due to the pandemic, and the Asian Football Confederation has recently decided to let Suzhou host the rest of the matches in Group A of the Asian qualifiers, which consists of China, the Philippines, Syria, Maldives, and Guam from May 31st to June 15th. China will play the Philippines and Syria. Head coach Li Tie told the press he is happy to play the games on home soil and expects many Chinese fans to be able to go to see the games and support them. The camp will last about two weeks and will be finished on April 3rd. It includes two warm-up games against teams from Henan and Shandong province who will try to replicate the styles of the Philippines and Syria. Four naturalized players are on the list for the training camp. Allen and Elkison showed up on Sunday afternoon, but the other two, Fernando Henrique de Conceição and Tias Browning, were not available to come due to the injuries. The coaching staff is considering having more players join the camp to fill in the positions of the injured players. Lee says the door of the national team is open to all who want to play for the nation so long as the players can train hard, have a positive attitude and a good performance in the league. Actually, we have organized the two warm-up games to prepare for our two World Cup qualifiers against the Philippines and Syria. The scores for the games are not important. What we will focus on is making more combinations and providing more room for players to demonstrate themselves in the games. At the same time, our coaching team can have a rough idea about the performance of our players in real games.